They are small and persistent, and anyone who encounters them runs the risk of succumbing to a deadly disease from their bite. We're talking about insects, the carriers of diseases such as malaria, dengue fever, and yellow fever, to name but a few. That's why insect repellents have become increasingly important. Dangerous insects and pathogens, previously limited to tropical climes, are beginning to spread into other regions. Helped on their way. Insects find their blood host by following exhaled carbon dioxide and by recognizing specific scent patterns. Applying a repellent such as saltidine changes this specific scent pattern so drastically that the hematophagous, blood-sucking insects can no longer identify the potential blood host. Insects will continue to avoid treated areas of skin for as long as this protective layer remains intact. But how long do the various repellents last? Cage tests are a low-cost and efficient means of assessing the efficacy of saltidine. The test involves filling a test cage with 250 female mosquitoes. If the tester places his or her arm in the cage, he or she will be immediately identified as a blood host. Saltadine is applied to the tester's forearm. All there is to do now is wait. The mosquitoes briefly land on the treated skin only to fly off again without trying to feed. The number of bites is counted at predetermined intervals. The results are as follows. 10% formulations of the active ingredient offer three to five hours of protection. 20% cream saltadine formulations protect the user for up to 14 hours. And 20% spray saltadine formulations protect up to 12 hours, which is a major advantage over other products.